Hello students. In today's class, we are going to learn how to draw this beautiful flower pot. First, draw a line, straight line, and balancing the straight line, draw the pot like this. See, and erase the unnecessary parts. After that, draw the hibiscus. In previous class, you have learned how to draw hibiscus. So, apply that technique here and complete the hibiscus like this. See? See, and erase the unnecessary parts. Now, take the crimson color, border the petals of the hibiscus and with the same color do a little bit shading over there see like this see the direction now take the red color shade it mixing up with the crimson color like this see and leave a little space now take the vermilion red color and Feel the rest mixing up with the red color. Three colors have been used here crimson, red, and vermilion red. So, after completing the petals, take the Persian blue color and border the pot like this. See, border it completely and shade it with the same color like this in this direction see with Persian blue only here also same direction same technique now take the dark blue color and do it in the same way mixing up with the Persian blue. Now take the sky blue color and shade it mixing up with the blue and Persian blue. Color should be well mixed, okay? Like this. See, here also. Like this, same direction, same technique. Leave a little bit space there. Now, again, using the Prussian blue color, make the corners darker. See, make a little bit space there, not too much, like this. And now take the white color, and with the help of white color, fill the rest up, mixing up with the sky blue. like this see here also it should be well mixed now with the Persian blue again I am making this side darker now using the dark brown color I am just filling this gap now I am drawing a base here and using light pink color I'm just shading a little bit here just to create a base nothing else now take the black color and apply it on the sides
just to give a dark effect and it's all done hope you children enjoyed today's class and practice it at home thank you